ready start all over the country since independence there has been a great deal of enthusiasm among the people particularly among our young men and women to rebuild our nation it is very remarkable but then before one takes up this work one must have a clear idea of our country that is to be as you are aware an engineer before he begins the construction of any building gets full information first as to what purpose the building will be used like school hospital or public office after that he draws the plan and then constructs the building accordingly therefore we also must have a clear picture of the future india and then begin building the nation i am sure we are not going to make india a great military nation because no military power has lived long we are a poor nation and we want wealth to be able to feed our masses but bread and butter alone will not solve our problems people of other advanced nations do not have peace of mind and real happiness in spite of their wealth look at the young people of some of these advanced countries some of them are very rich but often they have no goal in life we want military strength to protect our freedom and not to fight with our neighbors we want wealth to feed our masses who are poor but this cannot be the ideal of the nation something more is required besides these two we want something more which will bring peace to us along with wealth and power it is advisable for us to go through our ancient history and see how great india was in power wealth and happiness during those days during that period evidently we had great ideals that could make india so great in the past but then how has this sudden fall comes about we have to find out the causes that led to this downfall in constructing future india we must accept the ideals that made us great and try to learn and put into practice what were not there at that time we must utilize the new methods of science for the welfare of our people we should not forget the moral and cultural values we have been following in the past and these values only have kept us as a nation for the last 3000 years